So we're back for game two. We thought we were going to get a little five-minute break, but that is not the case. Apparently, if you're on a five-minute delay, <laughs> you lose out on your five-minute break. We got the Zoe band coming in. I I guess King Branflakes enjoys playing Zoe. I thought he was more of a Zed player. I wonder if they're going to first pick him Zed. Or if he's so comfortable on a lot of different assassins that he's able to just play anything and he isn't worried about what gets banned out for him. I gotcha. Yeah. Uh, uh, the Elise band coming I, down again. I would definitely say that... Um, we got the Aphelios band coming in there it from is. Murray State. Not surprising at all. that was going to happen. If I was Murray State, I would not ban Akali. I would just have... Let them have it and Let them have it and pick, pick it? Galio. Yeah. There's, there's no reason uh, Akali <laughs> should get fed. Um, or if they if they desperately want to go with the Ari, the uh, they would happen? need to go with the Hextech GLP build. A Just Jinx the, band. The Jinx band, the Akali band coming down. Scraw was really hoping. I was talking with him before. It's my former roommate. He was really hoping to get his Jinx. Really? Because Jinx is an outstanding carry champ. If you just can keep no Jinx Caitlin? alive... Jinx. <laughs> that is a reference to an earlier match where <laughs> Scraw had 16 kills. Oh, loves <laughs> he, the Caitlyn. Loves he was, the Caitlyn. He was, his heart and soul was just bleeding out onto the keyboard as he tried to desperately carry this game uh, as Caitlyn, and it just it did not work. <laughs> well, I want to say, if I was coaching this team, if I was coaching the Murray okay. State team, I would be spending the majority of my time going, calm down. We okay. got a good double kill. We got a good triple kill. We don't have to go faster yet. Okay. The engages are happening way too quickly for Mary State in the mid late game. They're, I don't want to say they're tilted. I'm just wanting to say they're trying to be opportunistic when they shouldn't be. Okay. Wait for two people for a 2v1. Don't go in for a 1v1 thinking it's a 1v1 because it's usually not. Vision game is still not exactly where I want it to be. Okay. And the counter jungling is not there. But that's because I'm a jungle main. I want to see a lot more counter jungling. But Murray State has got to slow it down. Build scaling champions. Keep the game slow. Because they can't play fast. Right. We just saw that happen. We saw that all last semester. I want Murray State to slow it down. Take a deep breath. <laughs> Take a deep breath. I want Blackwing on Vigar. I want him building stacks the entire match. I want okay. top lane on Nasus building stacks the entire <laughs> You're match. You were going for that late game comp. I then. want that late game Murray State. You can't beat us because we're just too big at this point. Okay. Or, or like a Garen up top that just has all the hit points in the world and every ability to get in and get out and take a shot or two. Okay. The late game ADC, I don't know who that is. The, the late game support, I don't know who that is. Support, uh, Riot does not like support. <laughs> they, they nerfed support items. Oh, where... we're only two less than Boise State right now. Come on, we got to get more viewers. Hey, get some people in this Someone stream. plug our Twitch on Boise State's yeah, Twitch chat and plug... see if we can't steal no, a few we'll of get in trouble for that. <laughs> plug it on Reddit. We did get some plugs and some other things. We are here. This is Murray State University versus Wright State Raiders. Wright State is up one to nothing against Murray State University Racer Esports. This is the Riot Collegiate 2020 season. Woot woot. That is right. We're in North Conference. Have you looked at those conferences? There are like eight. We I have, have North, not. South, East, West, plus actual conferences that have teamed up with Riot. Interesting. Yeah, There's North a lot of is players. massive. There's 106 teams in North. Oh my North. gosh. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of esports in uh, states where it's cold along part of the year. Oh, because you can't leave your house. Because <laughs> you can't leave your house. Uh, so, yeah, all right. So, Murray State going with the Jarvan, going with the Caitlyn, going with the Nami support, more than likely. KG is pretty comfortable on the Nami. They are. I don't think I've ever Swain. seen... Swain's your scaling support because he builds That's stacks true. all game. Yeah, any AP support is good for scaling. I don't know how that comp works well together, though, is the problem. If you've got Nasus who's AP... Um, a Nasus is... You, you build AD on him. You build AD. If you build AP, uh, it's, it's more fun. <laughs> but you will lose. <laughs> but you'll have a good time the whole yeah. time you do. They're letting the cannon through. They let the... And that's what I... I actually wanted to talk about that. They did let the Kennen through with a, a borderline Kennen one trick top. They decided that was worth banning, I guess, the Akali. Is this next it, level BM? Are they like, we're not afraid of your one trick? We're more I, afraid of your Akali. I wish we could be on, on do the, the mic check with 
Murray State, because I, I guarantee the conversation went something like, do you care if they have Kennen? And Caleb said, no, I can dumpster out of Kennen. And Kyle said, okay, ban Akali. <laughs> and that was it. But, but I would have preferred an Akali games. ban. Or I would have preferred Akali be let through and with Galio picked mid lane. Uh, and everything else just just <laughs> left basically the way it was. But does Blackwing know Galio? Would be my I don't concern. actually know. I, I know be. him as a Vagar player and, like you said, a Cassidy player. Right. Not an Ari player. Should he be on gold team if he can't play Galio, though? I don't know. He is a substitute. For <laughs> oh, that's true. Okay. Um, we because got tryouts haven't happened yet, uh, but we love everybody on the team. We're just we're just being That's sniped. true. Yeah, we just love some more than Zach others. Zach Jungle, right? Yes. Right? That's going to be pretty fun. A heavy, a heavy tank. Hyper ganker. He charges up and launches himself anywhere on the map he so pleases. <laughs> and he just, just, he just appears. Years. We have more than boys. Yes! Yes. This, this is a problem right here. Senna, the infinite scaling champ. The uh, third one in all of League of Legends, I believe. And at, Correct in me if ADC, I'm wrong, Twitch. Not in the support role. No, he is ADC. It's going to be insane because there's your CC and then yep. there's your kill. And then there's your follow-up CC. If yep. Morgana can land a Q, Senna can follow up with another Q. And then I presume whoever their mid laner oh. is will be able to. I would not want to see. Jace does counter Kennen. I don't want to see a Jace because Jace does not do well in team fights. I don't want to see Murray State's Vladimir, though. I'm not going to lie. We have a Jace. <laughs> Murray State's Vlad, the last time I watched it, did not go well. It did. <laughs> and Vlad is also known as a, a climber champ. He is. But. If you can get to late game with Vladimir. Having farmed well, it doesn't uh -oh. matter how many. Uh oh. And there it is. That is it that the Owen Tenyas will power spike? Or the or is ten, it the ten and, and oh. Oh. <laughs> That spike. is always the question. We got some switch ups going. Just looking at comps, so Murray State picked that Jarvan. I don't know if it was a, a BM pick. Like, this is how you play Jarvan, even though I was pretty happy with how Wright State played Jarvan before. Oh, it, it got through. We got, yeah, we got. We got the Cassidy. The Cassidy on Blackwing. Is this really Kennen support? And Morgana top? I know I, I said before that. Oh, no, okay. they switched. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that would have been, I would have been spicy. That would have been one heck of a match to lose. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? They keep switching around. I think yeah. they're just goofing off, having a good time. I, I love this comp from Wright State, to be perfectly honest. That's, yeah. Because I was I was looking for the fast damage. That was the only thing they were missing. So oh, it's, that can, it's Zach and, and then Exactly. There's Yasuo right there. Their last pick, I was thinking, you need something that can just uh, high attack speed, high crit. They pick Yasuo, and uh, oof. <laughs> As a Murray State fan, I am upset. <laughs> here's what I expect to see happen. Zach is going to instigate the fight. Get the CC in. Yep. Senna is going to shoot her ult to throw the shield on him and put a little mm -hmm. damage on Murray State. Yasuo is going to win well. Cha 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 cha. Slam yep. him down. And if anybody's still alive, Ken and ulti, it's done. Yep. Sounds about right. Yep. Um, interesting thing to know: Zach's ultimate and his CC pro can proc Yasuo ultimate. So if Zach can ult in, Yasuo could get two or three people. It's yeah, it's wombo combo. So down. if if Murray State clumps. Then Kennen Ultimate will get all of them. Zack Ultimate will get all of them, which will lead into a Yasuo Ultimate getting all of them, which will lead into a Senna Ultimate getting all of them. And then Morgana Ultimate can get three of them. Yeah. So if they clump, they will lose. <laughs> Again. I wouldn't. I, I, I think Murray State really needs to stay away from the team fight. They do. Split push. They have an split outstanding push, split push, team fight split comp. Split push. Jace is not particularly strong right now. I don't remember the last time I've actually seen a Jace. He's good at dishing out damage pretty much one at a time. Yeah. He can give out one big burst, one big burst, one big burst every few seconds. Mm -hmm. Split pushing is good. Um, I think their best bet right here, Murray State's comp is interesting. I don't think Jarvan fits into this comp very well. Because uh, Blackwing goes in with his Cassidy. He one-shots someone of his choosing aside from Zach, and then he gets out while everybody else split pushes. Jarvan's a heavy engaged champ, and Murray State does not want to engage here. I'm afraid they picked Jarvan because they didn't want to burn a ban on it. Okay. So like, let's take Jarvan instead of ban it just so that they don't get it. Yes. But that's usually not the way you should always go with these things. Right. Especially in, in something that does... It looks like Wright State 
coordinated their team comp very well. Very well. And Murray, Murray State, State is... everybody picked the champion they wanted yeah. without too we much need, thought. We need for... our comfort picks right yes. now. I would have loved... I, Looking at it, I think the support I would have really wanted here uh, is a Zyra. I, I, <laughs> You're going to keep bringing it up. I, I, I love really my Zyra Kyle support. Upset. I, I'm i very sad. Uh, KG for those is great people. on Nami. KG is amazing on Swain. I'm surprised Swain's not here. To be perfect. Yeah, it was not It was not picked not or banned. banned. Or picked. So it's really good, especially if you take Electrocute, you get that early harass. Um, yeah, exactly. Yeah, Whereas in each player, players themselves on the stream. Yep. yep. And, and we don't want to fault, like, it's a student-run team. They're here to have fun. That's, That's true. a very important part of it. Obviously, winning is fun. <laughs> it's more fun when you win. <laughs> it is more fun when you win. But if they feel like there's no way we're going to win this, let's let's just have a good time. Have a grand old time. This, this is what we're going to do. I get. respect that. I, I'm, I'm not going to I'm not gonna feel bad as long as they're having a good time. That's what's most important. So um, you said you wanted to see a bit more counter jungling yeah. and a bit slower down on fights. Yep. Um, I would love to see more counter jungling as well. And I would love to see, well, I would love to see fights just from a spectator standpoint, but from a Murray state fan, I would love there to be no fights. <laughs> right. Oh, we have the true damage. Yasuo Never scheme. mind. We lose. <laughs> yeah. Now can we a... as spectators type slash FF slash or is FF. it, uh, is it just the players? <laughs> and we are in the game. Let me get the overlay turned back on and transitions. And I love that alt tab. There we go. We've got your mini map. It should show up here in a moment. We'll turn on the scoreboard, turn off the time frame, and turn on the objective timers. Murray State University in blue versus Wright State Raiders in the red this time. They switch <sighs> sides, which is go big blue. Go big blue. Much like um, people confusing us is Michigan State when they go by MSU. Happens to me all the time. They see the MSU tag and they say, hey, Michigan State. And sometimes I just don't bother correcting them. It's yep. not worth it. I'm curious if uh, Easy Fox will place down a ward and then go back for a sweeper this time. Or if he'll choose not to. It doesn't look like anyone's placing a ward. Zach hovering mid lane <laughs> while Yasuo guards the jungle, which uh, it makes a, a bit of sense, actually, because Yasuo is able to level one Yasuo has his his Q uh, his shield and his tornado if he lands that Q twice so he's got three abilities level one which irked me to no end when I was down in bronze <laughs> <laughs> and it's, back when I was in Akali one trick Yasuo was the bane of my existence and now just all of League is the bane of my existence right. well you know but we do love playing League of Legends we do let's not let's not uh I have, a, I have a good time. Exactly. It, it does come with some frustrations and heartbreaks, especially when you put in. It's like a relationship. It there, is. there are highs There's and lows. There are highs and lows. A 45 minute match can roll through, and you can <laughs> lose that match, and that feels bad. I uh, I lost a 57 minute match a yeah. couple weeks back. And, and that hurts. And it did. It and, really uh, hurts. Then the next match I lost was uh, the homework I should have been doing while I was playing the 57 minute match. <laughs> <laughs> We got a uh, castle wind coming down. He took that cue from Yasuo. Jason just looking to poke the Kennen out. Kennen loves to poke. So to, ooh, Morgana landing that early bind on the Nami. The Nami heals up a little bit. Backs off. Scra taking an auto. Nami going back in, able to heal up. Uh, Morgana's big weakness. <laughs> Another <laughs> binding coming in, but they choose not to go in on that Nami. Nami healing up Scra again, and at level one, <laughs> everyone is half health and nobody's happy about it. Yeah, yeah. this. These raiders are skill shot masters. They are. They um, they landed especially that Urgot last game. Yep. I don't think he missed an ulti the whole game. Probably got four successful ultis. Uh, there you go. That yeah, Yasuo Q hitting the Cassidy trying to dodge. Uh, and, uh, ooh, got the ignite off on Morgan. We got the flash, but he cancels the auto. Does not get the auto off, and I think Morgan is gonna live with two HP. That is so sad for Murray State. Got that stun coming off on the Kennen. That was rough. The uh, Kennen stun actually is contingent on, again, landing those skill shots. Right. Uh, Zach right there, he's doing his red buff. Looking at where would be the place to go, Zach's top, unfortunately, because Bot would be the best place to gank right now, he might be able to pull off a gank against Jace, but Jace has got some solid vision around there. See, this is where Murray State's jungler is already failing. He is not counter-invading his he bot. He is not counter-invading the top. He's at his wolves right now. He should have done 
Two big camps, Gromp, invade. Jack is low. Zack is low right now. Low right. HP. He just got his red buff. I guarantee you Jarvan is strong enough right now to take it. Yeah. Plenty of mana. Plenty of And health. if you look, now Zack does redeemed. not have smite. And uh, Jarvan uh, now doesn't have smite. But right. he's full health. Zack's low. Yeah, you're right. I think you're right. Especially if there's no one that can rotate to help. Because uh, Jace has pushed up. He's got lane prio. Right. So he's, uh, we see some pinks coming in. It looks like uh, Jarvan's going to try and make his way around and get a dive on the kid. And I can't really tell uh, what the plan play. is. Looks like Yasmo going in. And this could be a kill if he's managing to land all of this, including the Ignite. And we've got the flash out, and he's happy with that. Not much Cassidy can do. Cassidy is a late game scaling champion. I do not want to see Blackwing trying to face an early game Yasuo. And it uh, looks like Pizzeria is trying to bait Kennen into the bush, maybe? Does not look like Kennen's having any part of it. I was and, uh, wondering exactly. So stay. Oh, they're both choosing to stay. Going in, can Yasuo get him in the flash away? He got the flash. That's worth, that's worth, worth trade, absolutely. He just has to go top again in the next five minutes and capitalize it. We got. Uh, very safe down, a little bit of farm. Ooh, nice Nami bubble coming in. Caitlyn putting down that trap, but it doesn't manage to land. Skrull is hit by that Murray, hit by the, the Bind, excuse me. De dishing out a lot of damage, getting a couple of those headshots in. The advantage of a Morgana the Senna lane is what you lose by not having a healing support, you make up for it by having a healing ADC. <laughs> Which is, it's just not fair. Zach coming in with that gank, and it looks like they're kind of pushing all of their eggs into the mid lane basket. He did not have flash up, uh, but he's still able to get out. He was he, really healthy too. I'm not sure what that Cassidy and gank was about because you know, he can walk away. He can throw a few and get a shield. Exactly. And, and it looks like trouble. Yasuo, interesting that Yasuo chooses to back off when he does. He seems to be playing it really slow. He's not taking any chances of getting hit by a tower shot. Right. Yasuo was last picked, I believe. So yes. he picked Yasuo into Cassidy, which is actually a, a good choice. Apparently, Twitch chat says Kyle cannot dodge skill shots. <laughs> Go Raiders! Go. It looks like we've got some Raiders. Hey, we got fans. some. We got welcome, some right welcome. state. Always good to have uh, uh, both sides of the map, so to speak. Yeah. I guess literally too. We're, we're streaming for both you guys. <laughs> we are. Yeah, we're ta staying totally unbiased as we hope Murray State wins. <laughs> <laughs> we hope Murray State wins, but we're also... But we hope Wright State does really well. We're also knowledgeable about the game. But exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Go Raiders. Okay. Hey. I hey. knew. I know where you live in real life, yeah, Zaxfa. That <laughs> Zaxfa. guy right there. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on. He, you're on the team, Knife Cloud. <laughs> you can't do that. <laughs> um, Anarchy Cloud. has struck in Twitch chat. <laughs> also... Uh, Whoa, team Boo Raiders! Hey, hey, there we go. Hey, team Woogie coming in with 100 like biddies. <laughs> thank you so much <laughs> for maintaining loyalty. Um, team Woogie yeah. also works Half for the... Half of essentially B-Squad Leaf team is, <laughs> is in their flaming. For the other school <laughs> right now. And you are B-Squad, by the way. I know we changed it to blue, but you're B-Squad yeah, now we're again. Call we're you changing B -squad it back. When, when, you're, when you're hating on the Raiders. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you're cheering for the Raiders, you're B squad again. Yep. <laughs> you're well, we, we, we're having a great time here. And uh, fighting up Toxic. Oh, right, a league game. Yep. <laughs> we have a game of league to get out. Toxic. We see that Yasuo going in. If he lands that, ooh, ooh. that beautiful dodge right there. Kennen, uh, did he get his silence off? I could not tell. I don't. It doesn't seem like he did because Yasuo still managed to get <laughs> the Q off. Is it because. <laughs> Wow. Yes. Yes, it is. Uh, anyway, back to the sleek game. Oh, oh here right. we go. Oh, we got Zach coming in. <gasps> See, just like I said before, the Zach can proc the Oswald ult. And even if Zach takes it here, he's got his passive up. He's fine. He's yeah, fine. Yeah, and he'll be able to, to regroup. That passive allows him to <laughs> die and then come back together. If there isn't anybody there from the uh, enemy team, it's it's nothing. Fun little tidbit. Uh, if you, you can teleport onto a Zach that's melding back together, and it makes one of his little blobs invincible. Huh. So if your Zach's about to die, oh, Nami getting hit by another Q followed up by that root infinite CC. We got that chain coming out. The ignite goes off. She does flash away. Scrawl's able to dish out a little bit of damage right there, but it's just not going to be enough as um, Nami will be forced to go back and the Senna will just heal up everything. Pizzeria is actually having a surprisingly tough time. If Kennen can get that next proc off, he will land that stun. Interesting decision by Kennen not to go in for the old play. I'm gonna say it's because he did not have Flash to dry <laughs> and get it off. Uh, I wouldn't have gotten hit by that. The int is happening. <laughs> 
Murray State. <laughs> we need more Murray fans in here. I don't think this is going very well. <laughs> I feel like Murray State's already had an XP deficiency here. They are. Our mid lane is lower. Our ADC is lower. Our support is the same. Oh, we got that flash root coming in, and it does land, hitting everything. Zach coming down, misses it by that perfect dodge by Scrawn. Nami coming down in the clutch of time, and Zach does not have a passive. The ignite looks like it's going to hit him right at the same Zach. time as the top lane is just going ham, and so much happens. Senna old coming down. Yasuo's there now. He wanted to join the party too. Ooh. Does get that ignite. Scraw's final Q uh, and headshot is blocked by that Yasuo wind wall. A lot just happened in that time. I think it was a two for one. Uh, yeah. from Murray State. Nami was traded for uh, both top laners. Uh, yeah, I'm not quite sure what happened top, unfortunately, because we saw that battle bot, and that's where the camera was. I believe uh, Jarvan ganked, and then Kennen used his ulti to try and counter the gank, but didn't quite get enough damage off, because he almost killed Pizzeria, but was not quite there. Blackwing, unfortunately, is choosing to push up pretty far. I don't know where the Yasuo is on the map. Okay, he's back in base. So I guess that was a that was an okay decision. Yeah. But as soon as he pushed that wave, I would have loved to have seen him just go ahead and go back. Buy your tier. Mm. And now that I look at Blackwing's build, he doesn't have tier and he doesn't have Rod of Ages. Which is... I, I disagree strongly with that. Jarvan, go, Easy Fox going in on that. Kenan, Kenan forced to flash away. He does not have his ultimate. That's good. That's a win. Got the flash. He can gank top in the next few minutes. And it actually looks like I may have been wrong, and the Jace matchup seems to be working surprisingly well against the Kenan. Maybe the plan is to just let bot lane farm up and see if they can get the, the Jace Jarvan fed top lane. Perhaps. Make the Kenan useless. He doesn't get that damage off. Um, and it looks like Blackwing is rushing a Zonia's first item. Um, that's an interesting decision because it it bases it on the assumption that the game will go long enough to be able to stack both a tier and a rod of ages. A rod of ages takes 10 minutes, and he hasn't even started to purchase it. So he's looking at maybe 25, almost 30 minutes before the rod is fully stacked. Um, I don't know if the game's going to run that long. <laughs> we do have a good look, Carlos, in chat, and I was waiting for the first <laughs> dragon to actually get taken. First Dragon Car does Wars? go over to Wright State University. Nami hit by another root. Ooh, that Morgana oh. ult coming down, and it does not look like Nami's going to survive. She's going to die to the Morgana. Scraw trying to get in, getting a little bit of extra damage. Does not do enough in order to actually really respond. We got Zach coming down, and it looks like they might be setting up for a tower dive here. Jarvan is coming down, but he's pathing up. Maybe he looks like he's going to run into the Zach. And they'll probably just back off, opting not to do a tower dive with a Jarvan right there. Because that Jarvan ults, um, and he will just not be able to do anything. Can, uh, ooh, ooh. Scra with that beautiful headshot. We got Zach coming in on the backside. Scra is knocked up. Zed ulti coming in, does not do enough damage. Z uh, Zach ulti does not do much damage either. We got Jace coming in, trying to put down some damage. Does not quite get it. They're both very low. Senna does not have ulti, though. And that is a one-for-one one trade, it looks like. I'm not sure who on Murray State died. No, Nami oh, was, it? was coming back. Oh, Nami, right. And uh, all Murray State is in the bot lane, which gives Kennen a little time to free farm. But Jace is so far ahead in farm, uh, I don't think it'll be enough to help him catch up. Has... KG does not know that. that has, uh, has KG 111 dodged a Morgana mine here? No, he has not dodged a Morgana mine. Lovely voice. Who is Randall? I don't know, but Randall thinks you have a lovely voice. Uh, well, thank you. I, I appreciate it, Randall. I, I have one fan. There you I, go. This is step one to becoming famous. For those of you that don't know, this is Big dive And we got lane. a beautiful dive coming out of Yasuo. He flashes it out of there, barely managing to survive. And there it is. Hey, he dodged. He, he dodged, dodged the skill a, shot. Can I get a shoes up Let's for go. KG 111 finally dodging a Morgana? Now fight. we got the Murray State hype. And going now, on. yeah, Murray State hype in the chat, everybody. He dodged one. Thank he you one. for your we contribution. It. And it looks like uh, uh, KG is just trying to keep those minions off the tower. We don't lose too many. Scraw coming down, see if he can 
if he can farm back up. Skrull already having an Infinity Edge finish, by the way. Very important item because it increases the amount that your critical strikes do. As you can tell right there, I would have actually loved to see a Nami ultimate right there. I think they could have <laughs> Get the CC. I let think him they could pop have done off it. more yes. shots, get another auto kill. And, and maybe that's just me ignoring your advice that they need to slow down a little bit, but I was, I was ready <laughs> for that Nami ultimate. I will say that this does feel like a slower game. It's three and three, 13 minutes in. No gold lead. To exactly, soon. yeah. They're, You're right. They're down a dragon, but it's a slower paced game. They're, but there's they're such a, a farm advantage in the top lane that might do it. And it does look like Riot Stage is doing better on the objectives, though. They got they a are. dragon and they got the Rift Herald, but Murray State's going to get some gold plates down here. And hopefully Scrock can capitalize on that. Caitlyn is one of his best champions. And ooh, Morgana hit with that. It looks like we're going to get a headshot in. And he autos the minion instead of autoing Morgana, losing out on that extra headshot damage. That looks like a misclick right there. Yeah. Senna putting in surprising amount of damage you better and rebind healing that up because Senna is broken. <laughs> oh, and it looks like they are definitely going to lose like the top a tower. Fight in the top lane and the bot lane. Uh, the Jace Raiders just trying to give. A little bit of harass. Zach coming in using Gilly. We got the Kennedy ultimate. That's that double chain that I had talked about. And it looks like, ooh, big knockup. Yasuo coming in. Does manage to take out the Jace. Can't cast it in. Survive. Trying to trade a kill. Jarvan not able to do anything. I really wish Jarvan had jumped in there right at that second. Uh, we got the Flash coming out. We got the Morgana. Ulti does not doing it anything. Unfortunately, Scrog well, goes yes. out. Yes, Morgana goes down. Run, KG, run. <laughs> it is your time to fly like the wind. Oh, and it looks like that last one is an empowered one. Ooh. Oh, if he hadn't dodged, he would have lived. He dodged into F's it. F's in the Feels chat, bad. boys. Yeah, F's in the chat for dodging into the skill shot. He did dodge. Just he did, the <laughs> but just the wrong way. You wanted to go. And right state starting to capitalize a little bit on that. Oh, Yasuo ult is actually down. Can he kill him? He went to get the blue first. He went to the priorities. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not what I meant by slow it down. <laughs> I understand his thing, his process there. He's like, I'll get the blue, I'll have the mana, I can turn and, and auto right. attack again. I think the problem was he wasn't expecting Yasuo to he stay. He was the 4 and 0 Yas <laughs> yeah. against the. It is going to be the 10 and 0 Yasuo, probably not. It is, that's what it's down. looking like. That that master tier player able to try and carry that game. Set actually doing pretty well. It looks like he's going to be 2v1 down on the bot lane. Big Can't scraw. Do it. Yes, one last. Oh, Ooh. no, he missed. And that, There's the Nami wave. That Nami wave coming out, out just a second too late. Kostadin really needs to back off here. I don't think he should be there. Zach coming in. They really want, Right State wants to engage on this. They've got oh, yeah. all the ultis they need. Okay. No Ken and ulti coming together. Everyone dies on Murray State's just a run, Nami run for the second time this game. Cassidy, that no. unfortunate Cassidy ultimate did not land and he will go down for not being able to dodge over the wall, putting the Senna on a rampage. And right not what you want on Senna drag. and an Infernal Drake on top of it. So all the damage they're doing will now be increased by 2.5%. It will be much higher. So it looks like they're going to trade for towers in the top lane. Oh. Um, oh, can he 1v1 this Yasuo? But he's out of mana. It doesn't look like he will. Yasuo is not going to choose not to put up a chase. Instead, just being happy with the fact that they got the dragon. Nami getting caught out by another Morgana behind and does go down to Hippo. Let's mentally rewind a bit. Right when... So much happened. <laughs> right. So that, that fight happened in the river. Cassidy was not there. Correct. Zach goes in, gets the kill on Scrawl. KG was the only one left. Kastanen is coming down at that point. Ooh. At that point right there was when Kastanen should have stopped. Yes, they, they should have backed went off. down, back off, go back to lane. lane. Yep. KG's it's probably gone. There were four of them there. Exactly. <laughs> Murray State needs to learn how to cut their losses. Sometimes yep. you just take the kill, the bad trade, and you just leave. One person dies, and it sucks, but you got to sacrifice the one to let the other four yeah. win sometimes. The needs they're, of the they're many not doing the needs that of the very few. well. And when it's four of them versus KG, you're the few. Exactly, yeah. And just just the let the needs of the many is your top lane and your jungler and your ADC that's exactly. respawning. They need you to not die. That's time you're off the map. That's that's XP gone, that's gold gone. Oh, looks like we're going to get a 2v1 against the Yasuo. He will have a 950 gold shutdown, but if I know anything about the Yasuo, he's at, he can 100% 2v1 going down. Does he take down Pizzeria? Looks like he does. Everybody else oh, is there. Cassidy's there. He does get hit by the knockup. Kennen teleporting in. Got that double ult proc. Yasuo's going to come and throw out that wind wall, and he will 
give that kill over to the Senna for a three for nothing on Murray State. Yasuo not afraid of the tower shots anymore. <laughs> He's not. With that Conqueror, he is able to heal for 15% of the damage he deals. Uh, and with an I More IE, Raiders fans in chat. That is an incredible. Go Raiders. Hey, welcome to the chat. We have more viewers than Rutgers and Boise State. Let's go. Thank you guys for tuning in to this Racer Esports stream for the Collegiate League of Legends season opener between uh, Wright State University and Murray State University. Uh, Wright State's up one to nothing against Murray State University, and we are in the second game. It's not looking good for the races at this point. They are down 10 kills in total compared to And, Wright and State. about 7,000 gold. We got yeah. that Nami ult coming out. It hits four out of five, you know, for 80%. I think that's higher than my GPA has ever been. We got that <laughs> Jarvan <laughs> yoinking his way out, Ooh. see if he can just try and survive. And it, it seems like Murray's strategy right here is just kind of live. Is but, it though? Well, I mean, they're not. Doing, I'm not saying it's working. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just say that's the strategy. Thank you. Uh, we love all the viewers. Uh, we we are joking a lot here, but what we can see is not what they're seeing. Obviously, we minus have a bit more kick you. Thank you, Lazy Koala. Ah, beautiful. So we're able to make a much more objective, objectified view of this game. Yes. Uh, we see everything. They don't know what's going on a lot of the times due to vision and lack of. And of course, we do have Fog of War on, and the red right. vision is really good. I don't see any blue wards in the enemy jungle. If you look at their, the vision scores, pretty much everyone except Jace is, uh, is losing to their respective laner as far as vision score goes, uh, except for Nami and Jace, I guess. They're doing pretty well. And. Um, I'm, I'm good friends with everyone on the Murray State team. If they ever watched this back and heard me poking fun at them, they'd be okay with it. Wait and see KG dodging on the skills. I don't know if they'll be okay with you. <laughs> uh, we got a huge fight coming oh. in. I don't even know if there's much to say right there. It was a, a two for nothing. Did they even have to use an ability? Um, I think they used a couple of ults. Oh, okay. Zach and, jumped in, and then it was CC for days. And then that was that was all she wrote. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it just comes down to Wright State built a better comp. They did. And I, I mean... We said it at the beginning. Uh, I uh, both games I haven't particularly cared for Murray State's comp. We got that second Rift Herald coming down. I'm gonna bet that they're gonna take the inhib, take the Baron, push lanes a little bit, and then try and end the game here by about 24, 25 minutes. <coughs> if I'm the Raiders right now, I run it down mid. My skill shots are on point. I've got. Have they missed a skill shot? There's one. Some I'll dodge one. Oh, that's right. He dodged that he one dodged earlier. That one. Absolutely. And then he dodged into one. They're going to get the inhibitor. You might be right. They may just try to push this onto victory. We got, it's a 4v5 with casting oh, it down. Zach backs out. Which means Having a, a couple go rough dragon. games in a row. They do stop that Rift Hail from going on, and that might be the turning point that uh, just has Wright State back off just a little bit. Not so much a retreat, but um, a strategic repositioning. Yes, a strategic repositioning, which is another big part. Ooh. Wasn't even <laughs> looking for a <laughs> he hit wasn't, there. He didn't even know there was, oh, no. <laughs> Oh no! I just watched four skill shots hit in a row and they didn't even know there were players there. Uh, F's in the chat, boys. <laughs> maybe, maybe they did. There is vision, but it really felt like those shots were at random from Wright State and Murray State walked into them. And I don't was it Was that. it 10,000 IQ or pure luck? Uh, we may never know. We may never know. And uh, Nami, unfortunately, has, uh, has swimming with the fishes again. Is a joke because she's also a fish. Always swimming. <laughs> now this, you is, say this is what I'm talking about right here. No reason for this. There was there was an engage. It was desperate. He goes down. It was a flash as well. Lots of pings going on. <laughs> From the part of Wright State. Yeah. Wondering similar things to what Zach coming in with that jump again. Another more got him by lands for that solid 97% success rate. Zach, a little bit of BM right there. That's one of those things where, like, do you BM if, if you're this far ahead? Always BM if there's a chance the enemies can right. catch up. That's, um, I've actually never seen that Zach emo before, though. I don't play Zach very much. Murray's just trying to clear out these waves. If I had to make a call, I don't I don't see them winning. Jace, I, I know I said at the beginning, is a rough pick, and he's actually done pretty well. 181 farm isn't bad. One and two right. It's not great. He's got more farm than his, but his exactly. counter, you know, his, his uh, opponent. Scraw started off 
very well, and then everyone figured out that Scraw was starting off yeah, very I mean, well. Yeah, look at this, seven and one, and seven then, and oh. Exactly, and so Five they, and Yas came bot all the time, casted him, which is a late game scaling champ. He's about to buy Rod of Ages, it looks like, but Rod of Ages at 22 minutes? That's, you gotta start off not, with those kind of items. Yeah, it. it's, it was an ill-advised, another more caught up by <laughs> Speaking of ill-advised. Oh, wait, does he make it out? No, no, he's not gonna do it. I understand the jungler wanting to steal Baron, but no. But why would you even try? Yeah, you're not in the position at this point. You, you're, you're down in levels. You know, you're down in levels. You're, you're down, down by gold. ten thousand gold. You're down in kills. There's a Zac that can literally, you know, kind of grasshopper his way around the map. Right. Yeah, the Zac doesn't care what you do to him. He's got so much HP at this point. And yeah. And all he's gonna do is <laughs> well, get a knock up, and oh, here comes Yasuo. Remember him? Look, he's, he's going gonna in kill super everybody. Hard. <laughs> he's gonna get the Jace. So we got There's the Kenan coming off. in. KG111 does go down again. Scraw running for his life. It looks like he's gonna make it out. Zach, the choosing to recall instead of pushing an advantage, which is interesting. So if you're Mary State, um, we'll discuss the game when something exciting happens. If you're Mary State, knowing what you've just gone through for this match. What do you do at practice next time? Work on team comps? Work, Work on, on team comps. I don't think their micro play is bad. Their CS is good. Their vision work could, could stand some practice. Uh, jungling could stand to, to work on counter jungle a bit more. And Murray State has got to start making people fear their picks. That's what yeah. happened here. Yeah. The Raiders made Murray State afraid of the Fatali, afraid of Jarvis, yeah. afraid of Aphilio. Yeah, Murray State's got to start doing that two teams. Yeah, we talked about it at the beginning. Um, not great team comps either time, unfortunately, with the, with the Ari. But you just shouldn't play in competitive. I, I don't have <laughs> anything good to say about Ari. If I was Murray State, I wouldn't have played Nami. Shake my head. You can't run Draven support. <laughs> <laughs> GG's Murray State. GG's Murray State. It's, it's looking like that. It's. Red we're we're on a five-minute delay. They're probably standing outside this window. Oh, okay. I, I was about to ask so if Red Hungry Hippo was. Uh, is that the Zach? Yeah. Yeah, that is the Zach. Thanks for tuning in, though. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, <laughs> I'm assuming the five-minute delay. The game's over, and we're just here looking like fools, <laughs> casting on the plasma. Kennen Ultimate coming in. Don't Zen, ruin Zen the Ultimate coming don't in. Ruin the, uh, the yeah, yeah. Don't tell us how it ends. <laughs> I want to be surprised. Oh, 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 are we gonna oh get the did they get a kill? We got part of the Zack. It looks like uh, I think he's going to reform, and it's OK. Wow. And he survives. Wow. Go, um, Ra go Raiders. Go Raiders. Um, <laughs> I know where you live, that club. <laughs> right State putting on a clinic is what we would call this. They basically took us to church. Yeah. <laughs> it was. Uh, uh, an oof yikes of the greatest degree. I, think, I, I hope Murray State learns there. a lot from this, and I think they will. I think this will help them a lot with practice and obviously tryouts coming up tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, to see if there's any new blood. There's a lot of, you can learn from here. Uh, Reek to Freak. GG Murray. Thanks for popping in. The only Yuli. Uh, I think all of Wright State's uh, team has, has tuned into the Twitch chat because our viewers jumped by. Four or five? Yeah, I believe they <laughs> popped in. They're like, all right, the game's over. Let's hop in. Let's, let's see. see let's see do. how we looked on camera. <laughs> was my hair okay? Take that picture again. I was blinking. You know. Hey, yeah. hey, lots of shutdowns. Shut down. Look, we almost caught up in gold. Beautiful. Anyway, <laughs> Benchman. <that has> been <laughs> out.